Obviously, everybody cares what other people think about them to some degree, but the point is to get it as minimal as possible. For you to give a tiny shit about what people think about you each and every day, little by little by little by little. Now, I've been thinking about this a lot recently. I've been thinking, how much, how much do I actually care about what other people think about me? And the answer to that is very little. And as a human, as a society, we should care about what other people think about us in a certain aspects of our life. Obviously, hygiene, how we present ourselves, and how we are naturally as a person. You don't want to be walking around town and the people next to you are like, Damn, did you take a whip of that guy? He smells like shit. So I've tried to script this video at least three times already and honestly I'm not really feeling the script I feel like it's not giving me the depth or the satisfaction that I want to I guess get my point across hopefully we don't sound like a complete idiot I remember being a kid and getting on the bus and we had had a field trip I think I was probably like in first grade second grade and during that field trip on our way back I ended up peeing myself on the bus. Why? I don't know why. I think I'm obviously I was potty trained at the time, so I don't know why I decided it was a good idea to go pee. I think I just couldn't hold it. Um, I'm more than sure that was what was going on. But at that exact moment, I knew what it was like to feel that embarrassment and that discomfort from other people looking at you because of something that obviously you can control. Now, being a kid, I didn't really know how to react to this, so obviously I did what most kids would do, and I cried. I remember crying all the way till we got to school and the bus driver was trying to comfort me as well as a teacher because I was so embarrassed because of what had gone on. Now as a kid I didn't really know how to take what had just happened and learn from it or get some type of knowledge off of it. I kind of just, I mean it was out, and it happened one day and then the next day I kind of forgot about it. Obviously I remember now, I don't know if anybody else on that bus remembers, I don't even remember any faces at the time. Damn the back is always so fucking hard to do. Alright, let's see the shirt like this. I tried to write a script for this video, but I kept failing and I didn't really know what to say. So I thought I'm just going to try to freehand this one. And obviously we're already off to a bad start. As time starts to progress and you start to experience life more, you start to see how little other people's opinions matter when it comes to your own happiness, which I'm sure is the most cliche and stupid thing you guys have heard a billion times. It's like the typical white girl knowledge that you see on Twitter of a girl tweeting like, oh my God, you shouldn't care what other people think about you. All that matters is your own happiness. But as simple as it sounds, it is very difficult for people to grasp that idea or that concept and to apply it into their everyday life. Oh, this is so hot. I remember the opinion of my family and friends probably mattered the most to me. And this was because obviously they were the closest people in my life. And I'm sure a lot of you guys can relate. Now, I don't think I was doing anything bad at that time in my life. I was just, uh, you know, living life as basic as I can. But I think I've come to realize that people want to have an opinion or think that they know more than you do on every situation in life or have some type of input, you know, like I have more knowledge than you do on this situation. It's topic, you idiot. See, this is why you need a script. And even though they may not, it's, I don't know what the fuck, why it is. Because sometimes I catch myself doing that too. Like I, I want to give my opinion on something that I feel like I know more about the other person or not about the other person, but on the um, topic that we're talking about, which is honestly a really stupid way to be because times where you don't know what you're talking about and you may think that you have a good opinion or a valid opinion on whatever you and another person are talking about, when in reality, you might not know shit. Just that's the way you are, the way you I rock a watch, it's the only thing I got. I remember I hood a whole ass YouTube channel all throughout high school. I didn't tell anybody. The only people that knew were the people that I genuinely trusted. So if you knew about it, then obviously I trusted your ass. But if you didn't, then obviously not. I had this YouTube channel and it was fairly big. It was kind of big. It wasn't crazy. I think at the time of high school, all throughout high school, I gained like, I was like at 20,000 subscribers, which is like, oh my God, it's not even really that much, but enough to where I was like kind of sketched of telling people, you know, I didn't want people to know about it because I mean, it wasn't embarrassing or anything, but I just cared what other people thought at the time. I hid it from some of my family, from most of my friends. I still continue to hide it today. Not so much that I care what people think, but I mean, I've already kept it a secret for so long, you know, why does it matter if I bring it up? I, it doesn't, I don't know, it's not a big thing. 
I remember telling my family about it and they kind of criticized me for it and I thought, you know, shit, like this is probably something that I, I, I kind of felt embarrassed about it and I thought about not doing it anymore because of that. But I'm kind of glad that I didn't because if I didn't, I would have never made you know, money off of that shit. And it's like, if I would have cared what they thought at that time, I don't think I would have made money off of it. And it has helped a lot and I, I'm pretty thankful for that. So to basically sum up the point of this video, you shouldn't care about what other people think. The sooner you do that, the better. People are going to judge you because their own life may be boring and they're too afraid of what other people think to put themselves out there. So ultimately, in the end, do what makes you happy. Who gives a fuck? Approach that girl. Post that picture of yourself where you kind of look like shit. Pee your pants on the bus. Because in the end, no one is going to remember. No matter how bad it is. Thanks for watching. What's up, I'm Freddie. I'm going to New Mexico shore and I'm ready to party. <laughs> what the fuck?